Hey guys, good morning. It's 9.15 in the morning and I am headed into my OB appointment. Andres should be here any minute. Look at this weather. It is so ugly. It's been pouring all morning. It's May, like the middle of May. Today's what, the 19th? We're headed, we're closer to summer than we are to spring. Like, what the heezy, man? Okay, so we're back home. Well, I'm back home. Andres just left for work. And the girls are at school safely. It is a very, very ugly day today. I don't know what is with Texas weather. Like, I don't know what's been going on. It's crazy to me. But anyway, we're going to have chili tonight for dinner. And this is going to be my crock pot chili. And not like regular chili where you brown the beef and you put chili seasoning. Um, no. What? You have the key? You have the key? Okay. Love you. <laughs> Love you too, baby. Um, this is going to be canned chili. <laughs> canned chili. So we're using two cans of the Wolf Brand turkey chili with no beans in it because I like to add my own beans. We have some dark red kidney beans. I wish I had got some light red kidney beans. That would have been nice. Um, I also have some reduced sodium black beans. I have a whole can of corn. And I do have frozen vegetables that I could use. It's probably not as much sodium as what I'm using. But I want to use up my cans. So I have um, no salt, salt added corn, sliced carrots, cut green beans, sweet peas. I have a can of petite uh, tomatoes with garlic and olive oil. And then one can of tomato sauce with oregano, garlic, and basil. And then I'll throw in my own seasoning. And then we'll either have this probably over cornbread. And I have some cheese in the fridge that we could use. It's just one of those days. It's like a super chilly kind of day. I've had a very early morning. It's like 10 o'clock. Maybe like 10.30. Um, I was up this morning at like 6.45 getting ready so I could go have breakfast with Emmy since I missed yesterday. I felt so bad for her yesterday. She was really sad that I missed it. But um, today I got to have it with her. She was super excited. I waited with her till the bell rung and walked her to class and everything. She had a good day so it made me happy to see that. And um, I had breakfast with her and then came home, finished getting ready and went to the appointment. Everything looks good with baby. 145 heart rate. I've gained a crap ton of weight, which <laughs> I already feel like I'm starting to swell. So I really need to get myself to the gym. Probably all this sodium is not good for me either, but I need to just lay off like the junky foods like chips and dip. And I'm not a huge sweets fan, but um, aside from ice cream, I just need, I need to take myself to the gym and just walk. Like all I need to do is walk. But I'm just so not motivated. So, anyway, that's my rant for the day. I'm also having some watermelon for a snack. This is just the big container that we had it from. I'm eating directly from there. <laughs> Thank you, baby. I love you. <laughs> He's such a sweet man. He has to make sure that I have everything that I need. So, anyway, I'm going to get this going. And I'm going to let it simmer all day long. I just have a regular Hamilton Beach Chibo crock pot from Walmart, but it works just the same. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I'm in carpool line to get Emmy. And, oh, I'm so grateful that I always set an alarm to make sure I leave the house on time to get her. Because... I fell asleep on the couch and I didn't do it on purpose I was actually being productive and I was fine and I was like I'm just gonna rest my back from sitting on the computer I'm gonna lay down and oh, out I went <laughs> I woke up I'm like dang where'd the last hour go I was sleeping and it's just because I am still jacked up from sleeping yesterday I thought I was doing good because yesterday I didn't get much sleep during the day Oh, this sleeping on the couch hurts my neck, but I thought I did good. I didn't get much sleep yesterday, and last night I fell asleep like at 10, or maybe a little before 10, and woke up at 7, 6.45 to go to breakfast with Emmy, and I was like, oh, it was a good night. I slept good. You know, I should be back on schedule, and then there I'm on the couch taking an hour nap. I was like, dang it, <laughs> and I tried so hard not to lay down and you know get keep up with my stuff and everything and it just wasn't cutting it so anyway i'm here to get her and then i'm gonna head back home and check out the chili do some more stuff at home and then go get maddie 
and then start night time routine. So I just got done planning because I did not plan for the week. This was what last week's layout turned out like. And I had a plan with me on this one when I had my Mother's Day sale. So you can watch that on my channel. But this is what I did for the week. This is a Libby & Co kit. It was just a two sheet kit that she, I don't even know if she sells it anymore. Um, but it's like a blue, a light blue, a green, and a yellow. And I threw in mostly my stickers with it. So like this is my chevron. This one, this one, and this one are my chevron. Um, washi packs. That's my weekend banner. Those are my little weather icons, my to-do list. And then this washi is from Dollar Tree. Emoji sticker is from Dollar Tree. My stethoscope. I think that's stiffer, stickerific. And everything else, these are my maternity ones for being pregnant. Everything else is from Libby & Co. So just a real simple layout this week, but I kind of had to back plan because I'm planning on a Thursday, but you guys know I hate not having planner stuff in my planner. So yeah, that's what I did for the week. So my mom and grandma are coming over for dinner and I have... Oh, I didn't even think about that this would rise. I have some cornbread cooking in the little toaster oven. I cooked two packs of it, just the like jiffy, cheapy box, the one that takes milk and eggs. Um, I have that cooking, and then I have my chili. It's literally been simmering all day. Looks delicious. It has, all of the vegetables are nice and tender. The flavors have marinated throughout. It's been there literally all day. So, now I'm trying, my house, oh my gosh, is a complete disaster. There is dust everywhere. I know I mentioned this yesterday, but like, like, uh, you probably can't even see. Dust is just everywhere. Everywhere. You can probably see it better over here. And this is not dust that was there before. Like, you can see it's specks of, uh, what is Siding wall. What is this? Sheetrock where they demoed the area. Oh my god, this house is gonna be a disaster to clean after. So we're just trying to maintain for like the next week because the house is gonna need a complete rehaul. But so far this is what we have. They didn't come today because it was pouring all day, but this I forgot to show this yesterday. So they're building up this area so they can add texture. They put the end caps, or not the end caps, they dropped the whatever these things are called. This used to be our railing that was up here and they dropped it down. And then they uh, have added the poles or whatever these things are gonna be called. And they'll go through and stain everything and repaint everything and sand it all. And so, so far it's looking good, but <laughs> from afar, it looks a little gray. I can't believe it's so open. Now the playroom is gonna have to stay clean. <laughs> I'm actually sweeping. I, w I wanted to, but my mommy told me to, so I'm doing it. Now it's time to go. Well, I told her to get a baby wipey and to like clean some of the spots off the floor. And she, I said, or you can get the broom. She's like, yeah, yeah, I'll get the broom. So she was pretty excited. <laughs> and she never gets to use a broom or the stuffer or anything like that. So <laughs> makes her happy. I am working on these dishes. I just unloaded the dishwasher. I'm going to load that baby up. I have bowls. I need to grab cups. Careful with that, okay? Don't bump into it. Um, I need to get cups and stuff for drinks for my mom and grandma and myself. And a water for Emmy. And I'm ready to host some guests, although my house looks like a wreck. But just family. What are you going to do? So, I have a helper. I don't think you can see her. Stand up and eat the food. <laughs> If Maddie was here, she would love to do this, but I'm just having her help me grab towels from the floor because it's easier for her to do it. And um, we're putting them in the washer. And our towels have been smelling kind of musty or something. No. No. They don't smell bad. They're just a little, I don't know, like when you use them one time, we usually hang them up to dry and then reuse them again. So, um, the last time I talked about towels, and I think I got this from my friend Corey too, you guys said it's just like to use vinegar. So it's like a cup of vinegar where the bleach thing goes. So I'm gonna try it. What's the worst that can happen, right? If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. I'll let you guys know. I'm not in, babe. Well, <laughs> yeah, I thought about you too. 
The it's because they have their stuff in the garage. Oh. I was like, dang! Hang on, girls, hang on. How where are you? We're way over there. Y'all are gonna carry it. Maddie, we'll carry wait. It. Don't go any further. Okay, give this stuff to Grandma and Grandma Bob. Say bye. Bye, bye Grandma Bob. Bob. Bye. Bye, bye, guys. Mom. We love you. Mwah. Can you walk bye, Grandma. on the street? No, not on no, the street. That's too far. Only up the driveway. If we were just across the street, that'd be different. Okay, love you guys. Thanks love for coming over. I see him. Yeah, might as well look at the plants while we're out here since it's still pretty much daylight and it's like 8.30. It's crazy. All of these are flowers. Since we've been getting so much rain, they're blooming real nice, so... Yeah, now it's time to get these ones in bed. Hi! Hi! <laughs> Let's go, come on. I like this tree. It's time to go night night. Hey, uh-uh, leave that alone. Leave, leave that alone, let's go. Thank you. Grandma had to go bye-bye. It was nice of her to come visit, right? So I just got done editing the video, um, the vlog for today. I uploaded my planner themed my 2015 planner flip through I didn't even know what to call it it was like all the layouts that I did for 2015 and kind of like up through current so if you're interested in that that's already up on my vlog channel girls are in bed they've been in bed for a while and the dress just got home a little while ago he's downstairs eating some leftover chili and I'm gonna go back to watching Orange is the New Black and wait for this to export and then I'm heading to bed Hopefully tomorrow's not an ugly day like today was so I can actually run errands and do stuff. I'm hoping. I put this in like a little clip at the end of this vlog. Yesterday I had mentioned that I don't know that I was upset that I had read comments and stuff like that. I had just decided to delete it not even address the haters, the people that like to criticize me and judge me. It's not even worth my time anymore. You know, I think I'm just going to, instead of let it letting it affect me, I think I'm just going to delete them. Delete the negative comments, not even respond. It's so hard. It is so hard because they really bother me, especially when they're talking about the girls. But I just can't even bring that negative negativity around my channel, and I can't even bring myself to talk about it anymore. So I just deleted it. I'm sure those of you that stuck up for me in the comments and you know made your own polite kind comments back to those people and stuff I I'm sure you know what I'm talking about and I'm just I'm done I'm over it so anyway moving on to bigger and better things I hope you guys enjoyed today's footage and we will see you tomorrow bye